announcing a full menu of options for schools to choose from to provide enhanced and expanded summer learning opportunities for students in all grades. Our administration is committing more than $70 million in funding for school districts to offer summer learning and recreational programs that can help kids grow academically and socially. And after a year of so much remote and hybrid learning, we think it's crucial to give people these learning opportunities and to give kids a chance to participate, them, participate in them across Massachusetts. Under this plan, students at every grade level will have opportunities to take part in a mix of academic and recreational programs offered at schools, local community organizations, community colleges, and recreation sites. One of, those one of those opportunities will be acceleration academies, which have already proven in many parts of Massachusetts to be a powerful learning tool for kids in school districts across Massachusetts and is something that Commissioner Riley, during his tenure both in Boston and in Lawrence, has some very direct experience with. Our administration will commit up to $25 million in grants for districts to operate acceleration academies using federal elementary and secondary school emergency response funding to make that happen. And we know that the experience here in Massachusetts, the targeted instruction from highly trained teachers in one-on-one -on -one and small groups can help students who are behind catch up academically. The academies will be much more than typical summer vacation learning camp. It will be a multi-year program that the department anticipates will impact more than 50,000 students statewide each year. But the plan doesn't ask schools to focus merely on academics. Kids also need opportunities to play with their friends and participate in safe environment and enrichment activities. We're offering schools and community partners opportunities and funding to make these important activities happen this summer. And since last spring, as we all know, people have worked enormously hard to continuously adapt to the changes that come with this pandemic. And we think this opportunity in particular is another opportunity for all of us to work together to help give our kids some of what they may have lost over the course of this very difficult year.